Hello, humans and pets. We got the Frankenburger. Um, I'm looking what's in it. Um, we added, uh, I believe it was like a few things, mushrooms um, and maybe grilled onions. It has raw onions, jalapeno, mustard, tomato, yellow American cheese, Heinz ketchup, lettuce, and pickles. Um, and I think half a hot dog on this guy. Yeah. This is from way back, by the way. Way back you didn't, burger. You didn't say that. Yeah, we love this place. They make consistently good food. So it's got, it's got the grease on it today. I'm excited to see. Look at this Frankenburger. All right, it got hot dogs. It's gonna make a mess all over. This me. is what I want it to be like, though. So the mushrooms and the onions were like kind of like. You can add, you can customize this guy. So did the onions come with it? I do like the diced onions like that. Yeah, well, it reminds the, the, the me. onions came with it. I don't think the cooked ones did, but I nah, added those. The, the regular raw ones like that remind me, because it cut small, almost like a McDonald's, but better. I it's am excited better. for this guy. It's like 10.32, I think it was. It was like a weird wow. number. Yeah, no, yeah, I paid $10 like dollar burger. Bucks, it's yeah. a Halloween special. I don't think it's going to stay did, after today. Did you today. show it? No, it's today only. I think today only. It's got so the hot dog in it. It's a little late if you're watching this. The hot dog's good. I wanted, I, you know, it's funny you just took the words out of my mouth. My bad. They have a good tasting hot dog. Yeah. It is like a legitimate hot dog. Drop the hot dog. Oh, that was mushroom. Mm hmm. I added those. It was that and the onions, I believe. I just, I just swizzled the hot pepper down my throat. <laughs> I'm a mess. I'm having a hard time with this one. It's a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. Frankenburger, 20 out of 10. I mean, Remember I the last time I said we ate it way back? I was slightly disappointed at the moisture of the meat. It was kind of dryish. Mm -hmm. Not today. This is like cooked to perfection. Mm -hmm. It's frankening everywhere. I'm not going to lie. I really like the taste of the hot dog. I didn't care for the hot dog when we had the hot dog because it had so much of the, the, gold, the sauce. gold sauce the on it. Mustard. But I do remember saying I like the hot dog. It's a really good beef flavored hot dog. Like it, it actually has a good oh. taste. And a crispiness to it with mm -hmm. the casing. Very good. It's it's got a nice little smoky flavor too. It's like it's almost like a sausage more than a hot dog. Yeah, and the bacon's smoky too. Mm -hmm. American cheese. Super cheesy as always. I agree. You know, to me, the last couple burgers we did from them, they one noted them. And it made me sad. This has the it. mustard and the ketchup, and I like it so much better. It gives you that contrast of flavor. Mm -hmm. The pickles are delicious. Uh, the sauce on it is delicious. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say this is the best burger that they put on the menu that we've tried. Mm -hmm. I'm the best gonna... item we have from them mm -hmm. is I like hot dogs on sandwiches. So I'm not, gonna... it's not for everyone, but we eat this at the house uh -huh. all the time because it's just good. So. I say it all the time. At our house, hot dog is the other white meat. You know, people say pork, you know, is the other white meat. Chicken. Chicken. Pork is not what, what, what happened? No, red, they, right? oh, people, no. Pork is pink. You're not supposed to eat pink pork. Yeah, but they don't call it white Anyways, meat. Anyways, they used to have a commercial like, it's the other white meat. To us, hot dogs is the other white meat. We put that in everything. This is delicious. The only thing that could make this better, nice slab of bologna. With spam, I'm missing. <laughs> I, I do like my spam too. No, there it is. I just gonna say I didn't get it's a spam? lot of jalapeno though. Oh. No, I got a ton of everything else, and mm -hmm. I think the mushrooms helped it out. No, everything about it is very good. Mm. Cheers. But once again, whoever cooked this today, the patties are cooked to the perfection. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're moist, they're juicy, with a nice melt of the American cheese on the top of it. Yep. Yeah, 20 out of 10, 30 out of 10, if not the best burger we've had on the channel I do, this whole year. I do like the fact that 
you have the contrast of the uh, I like the raw onions on this today. Yeah. It made it it made a little snap that that, that changed the flavor. It's very good. Now, this is what I was trying to get at in the Bogu King review. That Whopper was 10 bucks. Oh, it's far superior. It's Whoppers far are superior. not good, man. They are not good. This is good. This is great. I, this I is don't, amazing. I don't disagree. Whoppers are sad. When Whoppers weren't $10, they weren't a bad burger. I wouldn't pay 6 bucks for a Whopper. Or 4 I think three fifty is my max for a Whopper, to be he honest. He actually stopped wanting to come here because he kept saying, nobody can get the way back. And, I, and we apologize yeah, for those people around way the country that don't get way back. Get one. We <laughs> never, we never found these. I'm telling you, it was a little, it's a tiny little, yeah. it's the size of the GameStop right next it's to It's smaller, it. I think. It's a tiny little place, but man, if they don't, and, and there's still people like Uncle Mike, I tell him all the time, he's like, we still never went there. They Do just it. make good food. He's never yep. been to a Five Guys either, though. Yeah. I'm like, oh my God, you're missing out. We've never been on an Olive Garden. Who? We haven't. Oh, on the channel, I meant. Oh. We're literally looking at one. I tell yeah, them all the time. I, I used but... to pick them, but you know what the problem is with Olive Garden? They have nothing new. It's always the same stuff. I don't even know what they sell. We have to go as a family one time. We have, many times. I don't remember it. And don't let them stop putting the cheese on there. No, you... I will be sad. You actually got... Uh, one time you got, like, pasta with, with sausage, and another time you got pasta with meatballs. Yep. Which I thought was funny, because both times I thought you were going to get white sauce, because you liked that better, but both times you got a red sauce. Can I, I have I one of that? I the last right? time I went to... You might have got... Olive Garden. Actually... I got... Uh, because yeah, okay. I like uh, was chicken time. broccoli alfredo. Yeah, and they didn't have it, right. And they didn't have it, so I had them nope. make broccoli alfredo and put chicken on it. No, they had it, but the, the difference is, is when I make it... No, no, we had to customize it. No, nope. yeah. they had it. And, no way. And, and, so you, you just reminded me, the third it, time... It was grilled chicken on top, tossed in the pasta with the, the sauce. The, the broccoli... It wasn't cooked with it. The broccoli was on the outside. So the problem was with him is when I make it, you I cook the broccoli inside of the alfredo. So the whole sauce yeah. has the broccoli flavor. They didn't. They put the broccoli in kind of at the end. And the chicken. So it didn't have as much flavor as the one I make which, at which home. Which is fine. You know, so it's that still was, good that was, for whatever we paid. I just remember him saying that. So you did get that one time. But you're I, super bread, like what do you got? Super salad. Is it all you can eat super salad? Is that how it works? Yeah. Like a super salad? It's super like a really salad. big super salad? No, you can get, they, they can keep, they, they have like four different soups and they have salad. Super salad. Soup and salad. Super salad. Not super salad. Yeah, it's like a really big no. one. It's it's unlimited salad. They'll keep bringing it to you. Unlimited soup too or no? Yes. If you get the unlimited soup and salad. Super you, salad. So, like, sometimes your mother will get that. I usually get tour of Italy. Tour de Italy. Yeah, I don't know why you did that. That's I just always get that. I don't know why. It's like a combo thing of different stuff. And which I always like. But the problem fun? is... It, it's an Italian kitchen. It, it's all... Okay, it's not great Italian food though. That's the whole thing. I just know I don't really like their breadsticks. I think crazy beds bread's better. And I just know they keep putting cheese on there if you ask, and they won't stop. And I won't let them stop. I'll have them sit there for ten minutes. I'll tell many jokes, and I'll just have them like that commercial now where the guy's covered totally covered in cheese, and then, and then someone else goes, "You want some cracked pepper?" And he's yeah. like, "Sure." And then I'll ask for a to-go box, and then just stuff all the cheese, free cheese. It's. I I don't we know what their prices are like. We, they're expensive, and we haven't been. In Still, a, yeah, and we haven't been in a long time. We really haven't been in a long time. Your mother doesn't like go to Italian places, so we don't usually go. Why? Out. She claims she doesn't like it, but she's home making a pasta today. <laughs> so she says I don't like I don't like Italian food, but she makes like a meat yeah. sauce all the time. So I don't really know. But. Yeah, well, stay tuned. We're gonna be trying the proclaimed best pizza place in the area soon. Oh, you're going to go to the yeah, one by you? Yeah, we're going to. Okay. Apparently, it's top-notch food. So, I we're going to try it out. The it's pictures, wood fired The wood pictures fired oven. look good, but it's a wood-fired oven place. So, it's by Ryan's work, and uh, he's friends with the owner. So, he yeah, says he wants to try it. I just want to try it on the channel. So, All that's right. exciting. All but, right. Yeah, Wayback. We back, were going to do local reviews. Wayback's amazing. We yeah, we've done multiple. Wayback is amazing. They, they, you know what? More times than not, we get a good meal over a bad one. But I, I will say that. I, I can't name one. This ones we didn't like, but they weren't. We've never had a bad one. Correct. Bad. They, like, they, they're they, so good. They, I, I will say the last two hamburgers we had, they, 
the I wasn't a huge That's fan of the, the A1. A1. Yeah. And I wasn't a huge fan with, like the, with the with the butter, uh, whatever sauce that, that they just the had. The bourbon one? Yeah. That, that it, one was it, sweet. It, it was too sweet for me. This was out of this world. I'd get that all day long. I don't yep. like their price tag. You know what I mean? But then again, we just paid, what was it, $11 fate for this. And I'm looking at three new menu items on Red Robin that are all like $17, $18. So they're still cheaper than them. So... Way back, put this on the menu. You can call it something different that's not Halloween themed. I'll still eat it. And bring back, if anybody in working for them or corporate or whatever is watching this, which I doubt, but if they are, bring back that, I think it was tangerine lemonade. It was, it was tangerine lemonade. Phenomenal. You got to bring it back. I, I, I would go there every day. I think we did one time for Muya. Didn't they have a hot dog on a hamburger? I'm 90% sure. I'm sure it was bad. It wasn't good. Yeah, no, they, their burgers were terrible over there. I we got to go always go back. If you, ever, if you ever want to see it, leave a comment down below. Ooh, but yeah, they I make know, burgers. I know, they, but their burgers were dry. They just they just overcooked everything they did. This was phenomenal. Like, you it was you couldn't beat it. But um, that's that. Leave a comment down below if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you enjoyed. Like the video if you enjoyed. And we apologize that it's going to come out after Halloween, but you only could get this on Halloween. So we couldn't put it out <laughs> yeah. when it was actually yep. there. So you, just, think I, you think if I asked, they'll put a hot dog on it for look, me? Looked like next Halloween. This was a Halloween special, so we figured we would we would do Happy it Happy Halloween. On, uh, yeah, yeah. Happy late Halloween by the time this actually gets hey, posted. you can eat your but, candy while you're watching the video. There you go. Uh, shout out to all the Canadian fans up in Canada. Apparently last month, like, a bunch of people were from Canada. Oh, awesome. Like, the majority was from Canada. Okay. Hey. Shout out Canada. That's it. Uh, the Raccoon Whisperer lives there. Th th thanks for watching, eh? That's what they say all the time, eh? <laughs> check out Last Cash for Mash. Hey. He loves hockey. Uh, I, so I, I, I watched, go check him out. I haven't um, watched him. I've been watching rugby recently. I, what a crazy sport. It, that is a crazy sport. Um, but, yeah, check out Last Cash for Mash. For so those that are rugby reviews. lovers, we're trying to figure out all the rules. Yeah, and I we'll still figure haven't figured out. out why they keep kicking out of bounds. I don't get it. But it, it's, it's fun. It is a fun game to watch. I will say that. So. Yeah, better than football. He, he recently just got a peacock, and then, like, it, they had the rugby finals. So now we got to find another. So anyone who follows rugby, if, if you know what's coming up, like, like uh, you know, we got to find another because we just watched the World Cup, and we just saw New Zealand choke at the end. And Well, uh, to be fair, it was it was a close match, it was 11 great, to 12. It, it was a great match. He had two kicks, and he missed them both. So it is what it is. Three. That was a drop kick. Whoa. Well, that was the other team that drop kicked it. But it, it was it, – they. he had two chances, and, you know, he missed them. It's part of the yeah, game. Yeah, and they, they were difficult. Oh, they were, they were such a right degree angle. It was crazy on there. Such a good sport. It is. It's like soccer with football, American football. And uh, gymnastics thrown in it, there it, just because. It, 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 it's um, actually fun to watch. And it's nonstop, like I do enjoy hockey it. or yeah. basketball. It's yeah. just constant. I do enjoy it. But Anyways, check it out. A lot of fun. Um, let's catch one match. I make music. Check it out. I'm going to make it a movie soon. Wow. That's my goal. I'm going to make a short film. Okay. Um, so check that out in the future. All right. Well, that being said, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. You got to point at them. <laughs>